So on Wednesday, offices of the electricity company of Ghana were draped in red out of series of protests for the Ashanti regional minister to accede to their demand and apologize for causing the arrest of the original manager. If he's not apologizing, someone should tell him to apologize. There are people who employed him and they knew what he did was wrong and we have a lot of things to do. But if we get to the bridge, we will cross it. But addressing the media, Simon Osei Mensa rubbished the call, saying he will not apologize. I apologize for doing my work as chairman of the security authority in the region. No, I am asking, do I have to apologize for doing my security work? The minister justified why he directed the police to invite regional ECG. I asked the police to invite engineer Mark Asmani Wiafi on security grounds because of the happenings in the electricity power sector in the region. And the fact that a task force can always come from outside to disconnect without the proper information. One of the other reasons why I decided that no, they will have to write statement is the unfortunate situation that happened for which bowls and knots holding the metal frame to the concrete pillar of eight pylons were removed. We invited them to come to the Regional Security Council so that we can look at the adequacy or otherwise of security measures that have been put in place at the various strategic installations of the ECG, which they failed to honor the invitation. Simon Osei Mensa indicated he will continue to be firm in discharging his work as the chairman of the Regional Security Council. Nobody can stop me and the Regional Security Council from performing our security responsibilities as enshrined under the Constitution. With the Regional Minister's decision not to apologize, both the junior and senior staff union say they will have to meet again and reactivate the next phase of protest. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3 News, Kumasi.